Another day, another bakehouse. Chicken and cranberry roll with fresh cream donut and English breakfast tea in a wild goat cup from Fresh Cafe and Bakery Tarapa. Bloody marvellous. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope you've had a bloody marvellous day. On a Wednesday, my good friend RJ Kumar and I have time off together from teaching, so we go out and go on a little lunchtime adventure. Today, we went to the Fresh Bakery and Cafe on Tarapa Strait, Hamilton. Bloody marvellous. An 8 o'clock class meant an early start. A reasonable light this morning, although quite cold. Had to get the ice scraper out to scrape the windows uh, front and back and uh, one of the side windows. And then off we went. Good light this morning. Another good day, although a little cloudy as we headed in and got in more than um, early for the class. So I was able to get in and uh, set up and, yeah, get the class underway. So, yeah, that got done at 10, and then it was time to settle in for um, some in, uh, administration and things um, related to students, um, sort of more of that than uh, the class prep side of things. And um, before too long, uh, it was... 12 o'clock and uh, RJ finished his class and we headed off um, down uh, Tarapa Strait to the uh, fresh uh, bakery and cafe for, for lunch and uh, very pleased we did. It was uh, a very clean premise, very tidy, lots of stainless steel and the food was just, well, we both commented on it. Um, I mean, it was the pretty standard, uh, usual uh, bakery fare that's pretty common uh, around most of the bakeries, but it was just well done, tasty, and uh, fresh and light. So really enjoyed my, my lunch. I, I had a cranberry roll, cranberry and chicken. I do love that. Well, I've brought the cranberry sauce home and tried to have it there, but it's it's not the same as when other people do it. And a fresh cream donut, of course, and a, a cup of English breakfast tea in a wild goat cup. Uh, so then it was back uh, for our, uh, my afternoon class, uh, three to five, and then home and uh, just, uh, yeah, settled in, cooked myself a bit of tea and uh, into my social media uh, quite early. It's only half 11, so... Uh, we might be uh, in bed tonight before the end of the day. Yep, bloody marvellous. So all that involved roughly 2,800 steps, about four hours of uh, teaching four of admin, and uh, a pleasing 84.3 on the scale this morning. Usain Bolt is an am ambassador for which footwear brand? Answer in the comments below the video, please. Howie Jones took one of his famous stabs in the dark to say that the oldest university in continuous operation is located in Italy, and he was right. He also took time to explain how he has Irish uh, roots, but a Welsh name. Very interesting story there. Thanks so much, Howie. You're a bloody champion. Feel legit! This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.